chaos, the dirt, the trash. It's all in Amy's update. Amy and Sean, 1027 VGS. So Diddy posted some videos and pictures on his social media uh, over the weekend and yesterday. Uh, him getting on to his private jet. Uh, walking on there and then also some pictures of him white river rafting and cassie's attorney said i don't think white water rafting will prepare him for the choppy waters that lie ahead (laughs) (laughs) and then um now i don't know uh adria english i don't know what her story is but she's suing him as well and um she said after seeing defendant combs whitewater rafting and jetting around on his personal plane seeming to just enjoy everything um after after the atrocities that he's caused and uh has been accused of countless or by a countless individuals and being sued all over the place and he's just out there enjoying his life is uh very inter- interesting and in, and in, uh they said it's motivating them to get justice so when is this all going to go down? I feel like it, we talked about it like so hard. Everybody was talking about it, and now nobody, no one's saying anything. Like, what? They have to be doing work behind the scenes. Yeah, I, I guess so. But it's like also like how long you're going to take? Because you know, yeah. like we, there are some cases that are uh, going, they're starting like right now, where it's like, um, bro, that was four years ago. <laughs> like, pretty open and shut case. But in, in Diddy's case, like, let's say he's uh, dead guilty on everything, and he knows he's about to go to prison. Yeah, he's, uh, squeezing some white raw rafting too. I guess so. <laughs> I guess so. But also, like, when is Fifty Cent's documentary coming out on Netflix? Yeah, wasn't that supposed to come out soon? I think so. I, we'll have to see. I don't know. I haven't heard anything about that either. But hopefully, we do soon, and they get to the bottom of it because I need to know all things that are going on um, with Diddy and have been going on for for decades. Yeah. Um, do you know Twitch? Or I'm sorry. Do you know uh, Sketch from? He's a Twitch streamer. All the, he's big. Uh, um, he got big the past year, year and a half. No. He is uh, big time in like NFL. He's just a kid. He's a streamer. He's maybe in his 20s. Probably worth really $67 funny. million. He's, dollars. The, he's a Check Tuesday guy. He um, like checked. Anyways. Oh, uh, I, no, I think you told me about that. That's a trend that I have totally yeah, missed. Check obviously, Tuesday. I'm check Tuesday. Yes. And um, it just came out yesterday, Sunday night, Monday morning that he had a um, a gay OnlyFans account two years ago. And the internet is a terrible, terrible place because the poor kid was getting a ton of hate. Um, he was considering taking his own life. It was terrible. And and so yesterday he popped on and then people are like, that's not him. And he popped on and did a live on Twitch and said, yeah, uh, it was me. And it was two years ago. I was dealing with some uh, addiction issues and he handled it well. And he said, I'm going to take some time off and good for him. But it's just, he said, once he started getting bigger, he's like, uh-oh, uh-oh. You know it's this only is going to come out. I know. And that, I mean couple things like that's why everything you put on the internet is going to be found and yep. st- come on let this be a lesson uh and i just feel bad for him because yep, i really think he's funny remember blippy yes yeah uh-huh we all know what happened with blippy beforehand yeah he pretty. was trying to do one of some of the shock videos before he became blippy before he was blippy that that's, talk about that's, it, why, it was we to, that's why we had to get a new blippy yeah, whenever <laughs> which is not as good of a blippy as no the original, the original blippy was great and he, i think he's a local and uh whatever case blippy uh good for you and your empire but like you we all saw it <laughs> right, all right and i'll let you i'll let you get away with it because like you yeah. know when i was 16 I was saying you're 16, but you're, you know, I was dumb when I was young, too. Yeah, yeah. Man, guys, the internet is a scary, scary it's, place. The internet think, is forever. Think before you hit post, for mm-hmm. sure. Uh, lastly, Miley Cyrus. Ah, don't know how I feel about this. Uh-oh. In uh, In talks, there's rumors that she may be performing the halftime show at the Super Bowl. I don't know if I like it. I don't know if I like it. The internet likes it. They said it's going to be the most iconic Super Bowl halftime show of all time. Uh, Queen Miley. Yeah, this is going to be great. I don't know. I, I don't. I don't think so. When, when, when you think of artists that could probably benefit for, because they don't get paid, right? They do you like pay the, pro, the production is paid for, but you're not paid for. Mm-hmm. And someone that could probably benefit if you have a new project that you want to like have a nice pop. Yeah, I think that she could very well do that. And, I, you know, she's got a pretty good catalog she of songs. She does have a good catalog. I was thinking back, like, Party in the USA, like, that long ago. Wrecking Ball. I mean, I'll, but 
I just want to see know. her come in from a wrecking ball from like section 300. That's what and I swoop into. But the, the thing is, that's what I could not stand Miley's wrecking ball days. So I don't want to see that again. She can I just like stand her now. Herself at that point. Gosh, I don't know. I, I think, think it could be a coming of age. It could be good for her. her. For, yeah, yeah. yeah. But we'll see what happens. It's a long time away. It's only good if Hannah Montana makes it. <laughs> yeah, for sure. If she can give me a little Hannah Montana on top of that. And if her good. dad shows up and does achy, breaky heart, and then they oh, like they reunite. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I'll be there for that.